If you spend any time on Grand Avenue, I think you can see it from the freeway. Or really anywhere nearby at all. Well, I can see it from my backyard. Then you've seen this for 365 days. This being my shop and having to look at it every day, it gets a little much. Nate Champion owns Customs Hair Shop on Grand and says the second an artist from L.A. created the billboard of President Trump next to mushroom clouds and swastika-like dollar signs. It's a little looming. It was a talker, but he says this area supports freedom of speech through art, even if it's controversial. It's a point, it's a statement, and I, everyone has the right to do that. Others, like Afida Adams, say they can see why some are offended, but have chosen to find some ironic humor that may not have been intentional. But what I find humorous about this is that it is on a rainbow colored uh, pillars <laughs> representing, you know, gay unity. The billboard has been vandalized over the course of the year, but has since been cleaned and restored. And when it was first created, the plan was to keep it up for at least a year. But those around here say it's no Mount Rushmore. But this face may be here a little while longer. I come by all the time and I see people stopping and taking photographs in front of it, almost like it's a historical landmark at this point.